Hey folks, welcome back to the worst channel on planet Earth. I uh, just wanted to give a little bit of a notice, a bit of a mention before we get started here. Uh, if you're not familiar with uh, Chan humor and stuff like that, this is a bit edgy, bit edgy, bit uh, offensive by nature. So if that's not your thing, you know what? Close the video. No hard feelings. Just back out now, frankly, because it's not worth it. You're going to get angry. I'm not going to care, you know? So, uh, yeah, just throwing that out there. Anyways, let's get on with the joke. You are now looking inside your own computer. Boy, isn't that kind of fucked up. All right, this is going to be a little bit of a different video than the last few that we've done. Uh, I kind of wanted to just go over, reminisce a little bit about... Ah, fuck! I can't even speak. Reminisce a little bit about some old, like, 4chan memories, some V memories from back in the day uh, when I was still going there pretty religiously. And, uh, yeah, this is my captures and posts folder. Not just 4chan, there's also, like, interesting screenshots from other places. But yeah, mostly that kind of stuff. So I'm just going to be jumping in about halfway through the folder here because the first half-ish of the folder is really old, not funny B screen caps. Y you know what? You know what? Okay, just as a little bit, little bit of an aside, let's go way back, everybody, and just look at some like really old, shitty B screen caps. You see how many of these have the fucking like demotivational thing? That's how we did it back then. This isn't what I really wanted to cover in this video, but we're just gonna lo look at this kind of a little bit. This is the stuff that I'm skipping over. You can kind of get a bit of an idea why. We got a combination of no, this is Patrick, demotivational, and fucking this is Sparta. This is, this is Apex. This is, there, there, it doesn't get more 2007 than this, fellas. Step one, grease three pigs. Step two, Mark them, one, two, and four. Step three, set loose in a public area. Step four, watch the search for number three. Three? Ooh, where did he go? Ha ha ha, someone did that at my high school too, but instead of pigs, they shot up the school. Oh. Here's the mail, it never fails, it makes me want to wag my tail, when it comes I want to wail, oh that's gonna get me demonetized. That's, that's a joke, I don't get monetized, I'm too small of a channel, I'm completely irrelevant, okay? I'm so irrelevant that I can say whatever fucking racist shit I want, and yet I choose not to. That's just how good of a person I am. Dragons fucking cars, why are there so many pictures of this? Some of these are kind of good, yeah. Some of these, I mean, they don't need the stupid fucking demotivational thing. Ah, uh, science. Moar. Yeah, we got all the- I like chocolate milk. We got all the old memes, so. So that's like 2007 4chan. That's not really what I wanted to cover today. Not really the kind of- the kind of nostalgia that I was looking for. Not really my era. Hmm. Really makes you think, doesn't it? I'm a... I'm a PS3 fan. Really? What games do you play? Uh, quality exclusive titles. I thought the PS3 had no games. It doesn't. You know, this joke would be funnier if they weren't trying to charge me $60 uh, on Amazon for Yakuza 3. That game's 10 years old. They're trying to charge me like $60 for it on Amazon. Bravo. Bravo. What would you- what would you say about this controller, everybody? I would probably try playing on it. Looks a bit pointy as hell. Buttons are a little stupid. These don't- these don't look very comfortable. This Anon here had- had this to say about it. What well, the fuck I press the shoot, nigga? I, I don't know, nigga, try the Chinese button! Nigga, they all Chinese! Hey, go and pull us! How you say A in Chinese? Uh, pick up the delivery? Okay, so I've officially pissed off two races. I'm just reading the words, okay? This is just, I, I'm just, don't shoot the messenger, all right? In this thread, stories of the vidya that you pirated and later bought because it was just so fucking awesome. So there I was, installing Black and White 2. I never once played the first one. I only heard good things about it. I wasn't too sure what to expect, but come on, playing a god? How could that go wrong? So I loaded up the game and learned to play. Oh fuck, this shit is awesome. Saving my peoples from apes and volcanoes. After I got the tutorial finished and done with, I chose the wolf, naturally. So, 
Boom. Map number one, I was Greek, enemy was Norse, and we were in their lands. After building up my supplies and constructing up my city, I realized something. The devs knew that you people would eventually pirate the game. So they have this little configuration in-game where if you're using a no-CD crack, your children do not age. I, I kind of stared at my screen, almost dumbstruck, but I didn't mind it too much. I was just sitting there minding my own business and, and continued building my, my city with what adults I had. But then, all of a fucking sudden, I hear these giant war horns. Next thing I know, some Norse leader is screaming in my ear that he needs to kill us and a big-ass Nordic army was coming toward me. I had already sent my wolf in to deal with them, but he's been dead for a while now. All I have are a bunch of homes, 20 adults, and 400-some children. I can't turn children into soldiers and they'd get through my gate eventually. What was I to do? Being the all-powerful, immense, and crafty god that I am, I gathered up all of my children into one spot. My hand. After gathering the babies up, I waited for the Nordic army to be right in between those two big mountains in this really steep valley. Once the moment was right, BAM! 400 babies falling hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of feet from the peak of the mountain only to slam all face first into the oncoming barbarian army. Nobody left that valley alive. So yeah, I might have not been able to play the game in reality. You might have the best micro in StarCraft ever, or some world record headshots in Counter-Strike. But I just killed an entire Viking army by throwing 400 babies off of a mountaintop. Sup. At the hospital and my grandpa is still sick and I have to watch him fucking a man tonight is gonna suck. Hey Robbie, I think a comma would help here. That's fucked up man, my grandpa already sick and the last thing he need to be in is put in a fucking coma man, fuck you. Please, Americans, do not talk like a anime character. This is not how normal people talk. It is a little too embarrassing to watch, because she doesn't understand she is fool. But I would also like to fuck this girl, at full force in her vagina mouth and ass. Well, you know, that guy's got a pretty, like, broad view on the world. You know, I can respect that. It's like, yeah, you know, this woman's a bit of an idiot, but I would also fuck her in the ass. If we all could just look at each other that way, I think we'd all be able to get along a little better. You are banned! You've been permanently banned from V for the following reason. Starting a thread about video games! Oh! You just have to say that you're fine. Oh, you're not the really PTSD, fine, you man, it's really coming back. You have been banned from B for the following reason. Posting bears in my goat thread! What is the maddest you've ever made someone in a video game, and how did you do it? I died once while playing Heroes of New Earth. I died playing League of Legends. I died playing Dota. I like food! Whatever food you like sucks, you fucking cunt! Playing Call of Duty. I Punch Toilets has joined the game. After match, received message from I Punch Toilets saying, I Punch Toilets. I Punch Toilets has left the game. I don't think I've ever respected anyone more than I did that man. Type the noise that Yoshi makes! 102 posts and 21 image replies omitted. Mario turned around and watched as Yoshi chewed the shit log. That's what ha that's- that's the difference that 102 posts makes, you know? Life comes at you fast. What- what can you say? Walk into GameStop to buy Batman Arkham City. Solid seven cute girl working register. She asks if I played Asylum. Respond with, I, 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 yeah, she wants to fuck. Try to take out my wallet, but instead pull out all my spaghetti. She starts laughing. Shakily repeat to her, D -d 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 this is my meal that I prepared for myself. If you don't like it, don't be rude about it. The other employee asks me to leave the store. Scream at the top of my lungs, This is my meal that I have prepared for myself, and if you don't like it, then don't be rude about it, okay, bitch? Other employee starts chasing me. Try to run away, but trip over my cape and shit myself when I hit the ground. Employee hits me so hard I burst into trees. FUCKING GAMESHOT!
Find out girl in one of my classes likes me. Get her information off Facebook. Go to three different stores and buy duct tape, mask, and knife. Wait outside her house until her roommate leaves. Break in and tie her to the bed. She begs me to stop and asks what she did to deserve this. Break her until she's unconscious. She doesn't go to class for two weeks. Her first day back, ask her what happened. She says something horrible happened and she doesn't want to talk about it. Says she feels alone. Ask her if she wants to get dinner because I want to get to know her better. She becomes completely emotionally dependent on me. She's now my girlfriend and has no idea what I did to her. StarCraft 2 General, does anybody else think that the Ultralisks really need a buff? Well, they're not going to get one since the next patch is going to nerf them. Not really, they're pretty powerful as it is. Ultralisks are pretty good, you just need to surround with them. I've tried to fuck an orange three times. Every time it breaks apart. It wasn't very satisfying. ITT, Mario Nostalgia. Remember when he jumped on the guy? Yeah, that was awesome. Top tier, cat, grandpa bear. Mid tier, owl, no feet. Low tier, duck, Emily. Porn, now, I demand it. I always wondered why they didn't wear pants. Because they're animals, you idiot. Have you ever seen a bear wear pants in real life? The father bear or whatever the fuck it was smoked a pipe, so why no pants? Because they're fucking bears, deal with it. Also, a pipe is manly. Where are the bear dicks? Someone just go on fucking paint and draw a penis so I can fucking fap. This thread is two guys arguing over bears wearing clothes and one guy waiting for a dick. V.jpg I'm gonna come! He's dead and I'm gonna come inside his dead asshole! Oh god, yes! I thought I would post this here to warn anyone who's thinking about trying to get an iPad on Craigslist. If something is too good to be true, then it probably is. Basically, there was this guy that wanted to trade a 16 gig iPad for a BJ. I called him and I offered him 350 for it, but he said that all he wanted was the BJ, so I could have the iPad after that. Uh, I, I've never given a BJ before, and when I told my wife about it, she thought it was disgusting. I later got her to let me do it since she knew how much I wanted the iPad, and plus there's nothing but Apple products in my home. We met at the Starbucks across from the Galleria, and he showed me the iPad in his car. Anyway, I gave him the BJ, and it lasted about a good five minutes. I was kind of scared, because it was my first time doing anything like this, but... He made me feel really comfortable, because I think he could tell it was my first time. I was relieved when he finished, and he congratulated me on the whole thing. The guy started to act all weird and said that it would seem odd if we both walked out of the bathroom at the same time, so he said that he should go out first while I get cleaned up, and then I should meet him at his car to get the phone. I did what he said, and when I got outside, he was long gone! No! What? I can't believe this! I am so pissed up. Uh, I've been calling his phone all day and he won't even answer. My wife is pissed because I don't even have the iPad, even though I just gave him the BJ. Typical Apple users. Okay. Next meme. I always thought Amy was cute. Just cute. You know, in a platonic way. Like a little sister. Like a little sister I would plow. Just plow, you know? In a platonic way. Pretend I'm a girl just to get items. Meet a great girl in the process that convinces me to join her guild. Become best friends. She turns out to be a lesbian. Keep pretending even if it feels wrong. Seven months of online dating and cybering. She tells me we have to talk. Thinks she wants to meet IRL and get ready to tell her the horrible truth. Fuck off, phone! DON'T RUIN MY MOMENT! She tells me she's really a guy pretending he's a lesbian. My fucking face when we've been two guys cybering lesbian sex for seven months. So V, easy, normal, or hard? Start on hard because I'm not a beta faggot. Yeah, you're a delta faggot. Oh yeah, this is a little bit of fun. So this was a fake GTA 5 leak, everybody. Yeah, this is apparently, this was Los Santos. I don't know, maybe somebody could like, line this up with the real GTA 5 and its map. Maybe this is like, similar. And yeah, here's the other GTA 5, uh, leak image, you can see. 
buying games, playing games, talking about games, games. 2012, asking advice on V for secretly converting a metro sewer system into a Legend of Zelda dungeon so that you can lure your school's weightlifting coach down there in pursuit of stolen high school sports trophies, where he will solve a light reflection puzzle and then be ambushed by you dressed as Ganondorf. This is it. This is the most ridiculous thing I'm ever going to read on V. Uh, I've actually seen this thread, and, um... I gotta tell you, with context, not, n doesn't make any more sense. No more sense. Who's the girl at 245? Please, I need to know my parents aren't home and I have the computer for myself. My god, you are really living the good life, bro. The funny thing is, I'm 48. What's the weirdest glitch you ever encountered? The weirdest glitch I encountered is you being so fucking gay, little male fucking old. <laughs> I once saw a blood elf female giving birth on an RP server. I was passing by for a quest when I read someone yelling, Oh God, it hurts! I see this blood elf female on a bench, sitting down with some blood elf male dressed in a tuxedo. So I stealth and stick around to see what happens. Finally, after the doctor said, It's a boy! A level one blood elf logs in and says, Mama! I was terrified. Why did they take 150 monkeys onto the Von Braun to eat the 15,000 lice? And what are the 15,000 lice there for? To feed the 150 monkeys. <sighs> it's not gay if you pretend it's a girl's cock. Holocauster Tycoon, I'm not going on gas chamber one while it's raining. <laughs> I'm lost. Oh no! Fafarl out. OP, do you like steak and mashed potatoes? Uh, I love steak and mashed potatoes, why? Just wondering. What the fuck is with this character? I feel like I'm the only one who hates his guts. He's literally just a mango. How boring could you be? He also isn't even in any video games. So stupid. I can't even play Mario games because he's a moral fag who always wants to save the princess no matter what. What kind of game is that? What I'm looking for in a video game is a deeper character that I can relate to, like the ones I base my morals in real life off of. Saturday morning cartoon villains, for one. They know life isn't fair and they kill, kill, kill without second thought. I admire that. I mean, Sephiroth was the best character in a video game because I can actually understand him unlike a moral faggot. He's brooding. I'm brooding. Interest in swords. Yes, I collect many swords. Trench coat? I wear trench coats every day of my life. Kill without remorse? I would, but I'd go to prison. I'd understand his Oedipus complex because I too share a strong bond with my mother. She cooks my food and I live in her basement. Sister downloading shit on LimeWire. Britney Spears, hit me baby one more time dot jpeg dot mp3 dot tiff dot exe. Get tons of viruses. Anon, stop downloading your games, you virus the computer. If I had a sister, I'd put itching powder in her makeup and underwear drawer. Not coming in her panties so she'll get pregnant next time she puts them on. Do you even revenge? Why not just skip a step and come in her? Because then she would know it was me, you big dum-dum. Then poke a hole in the condom, she'll have a hard time guessing. Anon, you don't get it. The cum is supposed to be a surprise because she's not having sex with me. Wait, I don't understand. Why wouldn't you want to have sex? You fool. It's not that I don't want to. It's that it must be a surprise and not be pinned on me in any way. Then just swab some cum on your hand when you're fingering her. You're not getting it. I can't do anything in a sexual manner to her or else they could pin it on me. Alright, so here we have what appears to be a photo of a, a, a man doing some sort of a, a wheelie trick on his bike and there's some dogs fucking in the background and there's also two dudes uh, getting and, and giving a blowjob. And uh, somebody here has pointed out, hold the fucking phone! Those two guys blowing each other in the background is photoshopped in! I recognize that gay blowjob. 
It's from a picture in a park with them leaning against a tree with a bear in the background. Post the goddamn picture. And then somebody did. Somebody found the picture, and there it is. And there's another boy. I'll have to censor that one, too. And there's the bear. Yeah, so there you go. I recognize that gay blowjob. I've never seen V talk about this game. Just using the cover as a reaction image. Is this game even good at all? It is a mystery. 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 Seven. It is a mystery. Brawl thread. Try to keep it all in here, okay? 3,516 posts omitted. Again, the most important fact here is that vomiting feces is a medical emergency. If you see and smell shit coming out of your mouth, that's the body's way of telling you you need to get your ass to a hospital now. Do you think that Yoshi gets embarrassed when he poos out eggs in front of Mario? Sorry if this offends anyone, but I thought it was a funny thing, haha. <laughs> And I would like to know if any of you have any pics of Yoshi pooing an egg while he looks nervous or embarrassed. I just want to see it for a few laughs. Haha. <laughs> Another thing I'm wondering is, what do you think the eggs smell like? Haha. <laughs> I'm just curious for laughs. Haha. <laughs> I would like to smell them. Playing Kirby's Pinball Land on my Game Boy. Need to go brush my teeth. I brush my teeth in the bathroom attached to my parents' bedroom. Parents were already in bed. Open their door with my Game Boy in hand. See my mom's ass up in the air as she bends over with her face around my dad's dick. Anon, get out! Kirby music still playing. None of you know my pain. Imagine seeing your mom give your dad a BJ while this music plays. Reposting my all-time favorite green text. Playing soccer in the gym. Ball is up in the air. Think I'm gonna be awesome and air kick it into the goal. I try, and I miss the ball. And I kick the goalie in the face. I try to ask, Are you okay? And I'm fucking sorry at the same time. And instead end up yelling, Are you fucking sorry? Goalie is choking back tears. Oh. Oh no. That is so sad. Ah, uh, and here we go. This is me. This is my life. Reblog if this is your life, everybody. Share this with your friends on MySpace. Be, be sure to tell everybody on Fark about this one if this is relatable to you. Let's take a moment here to cover some comments from our boy Ross53545. Uh, cla the, the, the classic. Give her the dick. This is a fine ass pussy and ass. I would suck this motherfucking pussy and ass all night long. And he is eating that wet pussy too. She belongs to his black dick now. He is fucking the shit out of this hot piece of ass. Look at all that booty juice! I would love to suck all the loose shit from her tight ass. I will keep my wet tongue way inside this tight little brown asshole just licking chocolate and smelling good booty juice. There you go, Nicka, eat that good Chinese twat. The bitch is riding your black ass good. She needs some fucking. Fuck this ass hard for Obama! Die, lodging! You don't belong in this world! It was not by my hand that I am once again given lease. I was called here by humans who wish to pay me for an affordable place to sleep. Sleep? These men steal towels and make them their own. Perhaps the same can be said of all Red Roof Inns. Your hand soap was as empty as your rooms. Mankind ill needs a hotel such as you. What is an inn? A miserable little pile of blankets! But enough talk! Have shampoo! Well, back to playing cup and ball, I guess. Anyone have tips for chapter four? Try to put the ball into the cup. Never thought of that. Thanks, cup and ball, bro. Just rewatch The Incredibles. It was pretty good. What do you guys think of the movie? 57 posts omitted. Because Republicans don't give a shit about your life unless you're a fetus. Then you're the most valuable thing on Earth. Oh, and also, they don't give a shit about the planet. That's not profitable like oil is. TV, television, and film. 
That feel when wiping your ass with the manual because you had no toilet paper because your mom forgot to buy it that day but you only just realized it when you were sitting on the can and you tried to think of any other way but you couldn't and had to go with the manual because the only other thing was the shower curtain and your mom yelled at you the last time you did that and she bitched about having to clean the duty and she got it all in her hands and she didn't cut your spaghetti for a week because she was mad at you and so you're forced to use the manual and it sucks but then later your mom wants to use it for some reason and she gets mad at you because she has to clean the duty off of the manual because she wouldn't let you sleep in her bed anymore because because she was mad at you, so you had to go and buy your own bed. And then you pooped yourself in that bed one night, and your mom gets mad at you because she had to go and clean the duty out, but at least this time your Pokemon manual was clean, so you had something to read. I'll just see what's on Mew today. Here's a, a photo of the comments section from uh, PewDiePie videos from, like, years ago. I'm 12, and I love PewDiePie. Cake. I am a proud bro as well. Three million subs now, XD. Three million subs. Good job, pudes. You got up to three million. My oh, man. All right. Well, that's it for the captures and posts, I guess. We might do another video like this, a similar format. I do want to kind of shake it up a bit. Don't want to just keep it to the exact same kind of videos all the time, but sort of something like this. This the same kind of like style overall. Yeah, I hope you guys liked it. Maybe uh, some of you might uh, recognize some of this stuff from like the old days. Maybe some of you don't and you had a good laugh either way. Maybe some of you didn't laugh but you got a bit of an insight into a weird part of the internet that uh, had it was pretty influential I would say. So that was some that was some classic V uh, screen caps and stuff. Yeah, thanks for thanks for coming out and uh, see see you guys next time. You fuckers.